The nurses' union is fearing hundreds of job cuts as it awaits the release of government finance reports. The documents will be released tomorrow and will outline where the health department should make budget cuts. With the health department's finances in the firing line, hospital employees are terrified of losing their livelihoods. Quite frankly, South Australians need to be made aware that any job losses will mean service cuts. About 11,000 nurses work in the public system and it's feared they'll bear the brunt of any recommended cuts. The nurses' union says left in the dark, its members are poised on a knife's edge. It's very difficult for nurses and midwives at the bedside to concentrate and focus on the provision of quality care when there are these threats over their heads. The nurses' union vows it cannot accept any cuts that compromise their patients' quality of care. What we're fearful of now is a blunt cut that would not only reduce volumes of care but also compromise quality. The opposition says John Hill should just focus on health. He's also been the Arts Minister, sitting at the Opera and the Ballet, while problems within the health budget have simmered away. Minister Hill wouldn't be drawn on the issue today, but will tomorrow make public two reports into the health budget. Kate Dorsey, Nine News.